Welcome back, everyone. Today, we're diving into some groundbreaking news in the world of Alzheimer's research that could change how we diagnose this challenging disease. Imagine a simple blood test that could accurately determine if memory loss is due to Alzheimer's disease. Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, it's becoming a reality, and here's what you need to know. What's the big news? Recent research has unveiled a new blood test with an impressive 90% accuracy rate in diagnosing Alzheimer's disease. This test outperforms traditional diagnostic methods by a significant margin. Neurologists and memory specialists currently diagnose Alzheimer's with about 73% accuracy, and primary care doctors are even less accurate, coming in at 61%. This new test is a game changer, and here's how it works. How does it work? The key player in this breakthrough is a blood biomarker known as plasma phosphorylated tau-217, or PTAU-217 for short. This biomarker measures tau protein 217, which is a critical indicator of Alzheimer's disease. Dr. Sebastian Palmquist, one of the study's co-authors, explains that in Alzheimer's patients, PTAU 217 levels in the blood can be more than eight times higher than in elderly individuals without the disease. But wait, there's more. The test was combined with another biomarker called the amyloid 42 40ths ratio, which measures two types of amyloid proteins associated with Alzheimer's. This combo, known as the amyloid probability score, proved to be the most predictive in determining the presence of Alzheimer's disease. Why is this so exciting? Imagine this, a blood test for Alzheimer's as routine as a cholesterol check. Dr. Maria Carrillo from the Alzheimer's Association is thrilled about the potential of this test. She notes that PTAU 217 is incredibly specific to Alzheimer's and could transform how quickly we conduct trials and develop new medications. This advancement could significantly speed up the process of diagnosing Alzheimer's and potentially improve outcomes for patients. What's next? While the prospects are promising, there's still work to be done before this blood test becomes a regular part of medical practice. More research is needed to validate the results, establish guidelines for physician use, and educate doctors about the nuances of this new test. However, the future looks bright with the potential to reduce diagnostic wait times from years to mere months. Additional insights. The study, published in JAMA Neurology, followed over 1,200 participants in Sweden, revealing that combining the PTAU 217 test with the amyloid ratio enhances diagnostic accuracy. This combined approach has proven to be more accurate than current cognitive assessments used by doctors, which often struggle to differentiate Alzheimer's from other conditions with similar symptoms. Looking ahead. As we await further validation and widespread implementation of this test, remember that there are already effective ways to support cognitive health. Regular exercise, a Mediterranean-style diet, and managing vascular risk factors like high blood pressure and cholesterol can all contribute to better brain health. Final thoughts. The development of this blood test represents a significant leap forward in Alzheimer's diagnosis. While it's not yet available in every primary care office, its potential to revolutionize the field of neurology is undeniable. Stay tuned as we continue to track these exciting developments and what they mean for the future of Alzheimer's treatment. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more updates on the latest in medical research and technology. Until next time, stay informed and stay healthy.